good we gonna say morning but it's really afternoon <laughs> good morning hello my name is ashley morgan welcome to my channel i just received a package from amazon of contact paper i have started doing content on social media for cooking videos and my countertops are okay let's start from the beginning okay. i purchased my home and we're gonna say late april okay i purchased my home in late april and there's a lot of things i didn't notice until like recently because i wasn't at home i was always working but now that i'm at home i'm starting to pick up on stuff and it's just like some of this shit is fugly i got some marble contact paper the brand is called practical ws these these countertops have to go first of all it looks like they painted over it with paint I really want to change my sink too, but we're going to do one thing at a time, okay? They painted over it with paint, and as you can see, y'all see that? It's like peeling off, and it's so freaking ugly, and I honestly, this is not tap dance class. Go sit down. I, oh, oh, all right. This home is supposed to be a rental. It was never meant for me to be here this long. <laughs> so I don't want to change the countertops because the idea is to buy it, rent it, hold it, sell it. And then when it's time for me to sell, then I will go ahead and um, change countertops. But for right now, I think it's honestly just feasible to do the contact paper. I've been watching videos and they said all you need is contact paper and a blow dryer and maybe an exacto knife or a regular knife or a paring knife i don't know but i have an exacto knife and i have a paring knife so we're going to get this countertop cleaned off and we're going to start this video and i'm just going to assume that what you're going to do is let's go to the side you're going to just peel it right i would assume little by little I think you can take the whole thing off of it. That doesn't make any sense to me. Look at my face. Can you tell that I'm over it? <laughs> can you tell? I'm stressed out. <laughs> Your girl is stressed. Hello, everyone. We're going to disregard the fact that I sound like a horse and I look like someone's nanny. That's not what this video is about, okay? I think I finally figured it out how to make this much easier. And I'm gonna show you. So, I basically keep the paper from what I use you for and I measure it out to size, right? Okay? So that works, like I'm not about to hold a whole roll of paper. If this doesn't work on camera, I'm just gonna say that it's the camera, it's not me. <laughs> because y'all, I literally did that whole side and I gave up like three days, <laughs> like a week ago actually. I was like, I am done with this, I'm over it, I'm not doing it. And then the next row came and I was like, okay, I have to finish this side because it looks stupid and I need to put my stuff back. Is like take out a little bit of the top, right? Like maybe like the first inch. Don't go too far because it can be saved if you want <laughs> I go a little bit past this part and I go up a little bit. Wow, okay. A little bit on top. See the see the rope back here? I just pull and it's smooth. No, no purpose today, please. He was just working well for me. See, I knew this was gonna happen. Okay. It's just smooth it out. <laughs> it just worked for me. Okay, let's get the first one. What am I gonna do wrong this time? Okay, so then I just started pulling a little by little and then it just started working. But this time around, because the stupid ass cameras on, it don't even work for me. Asshole. <laughs> Come on, bitch. Do what you said you was gonna do. <laughs> Bro, like you embarrassing. 
to me right now. Maybe it'll work now. And then I just little by little with my hands, I pulled it and then just slowly. Now you learn, you're going to like, you're guaranteed gonna get air bubbles because I didn't get any with this one, like that. You're guaranteed gonna get small little air bubbles. I mean, if you really want to, you can go over it, but, or just like, I literally take a knife Put a small little slit and then slid it out, like slid it out that way, right? See that? It's much easier than the first one. Do my knife, and I just go under here, you know, real smoothly. And I just hit, I just hit the edge real quick, you know. Simple. All the extra stuff they teaching y'all, that shit don't work. I was here, <clears throat> I was here struggling for like four hours. <laughs> and when I tell you I was mad, I was on the phone with my friend and I was getting so frustrated because I was like, yo, they're making this look so easy and it's not. And he was like, bro, just take a break. <laughs> he said, take a break because you tri you're tripping right now. And I'm like, I'm not tripping. I promise you, this shit shouldn't be this hard. Like, I literally saw people online, right? Just... Like it's nothing. I only saw one woman. I only saw one woman who made it seem like it's a, it's a little bit of a tussle, you know? They're lying to you. The girls are lying. Don't say I never taught y'all anything, okay? I guess. Yeah. So I'm not with nobody. Cause I don't wanna hurt nobody. Did it over taste it and call me. Still got love for your mommy. I know you wanna be somebody. Even if you gotta leave somebody. You don't understand how good God is. So for today was such a interesting day for me. It is Saturday. I think it's the 26th of February. So much has transpired today, but God is so good. I pray for confirmation on things and I got it this morning and I'm so grateful for that. And that situation has been cleared. I feel a burden lifted off of me. But in the same breath, I also had made, I made plans today to go out. And I'm so grateful that I did that because had I not gone out today and went through what I went through this morning, today would have been just completely terrible. I met up with a new friend that I just made and she's so awesome. I am already obsessed. Um, and we went to Pond City Market in Atlanta, which I'm still here, and we had uh, drinks and food and good conversation. It was amazing, I'm so grateful. She's awesome. Hey girl. <laughs> but anyways, I'm about to head home because I know these dogs are <sighs> tearing up my house. And um, I really need to find a, a home for this puppy because she can't she can't stay here. <laughs> she cannot stay here. I just want to uh, I just want to <sighs> encourage anyone who is going through something that seems to be very emotional, very heavy for you like this situation was for me because it was someone that i i genuinely like was in love with but it is what it is so with that being said i just wanted to encourage you all and i'm about to drive home so i will talk to you guys later bye good morning well it's really afternoon here right now y'all um i first of all how are y'all doing today i hope you guys are having a fabulous day i hope that you guys are enjoying your or you enjoyed your weekend and i hope that everything is going really smooth for you all i am cleaning <laughs> i'm doing laundry i'm cleaning so my room is a mess and i'm gonna actually go ahead and like i bought some hangers from walmart um, I haven't tried to find these for the longest. <laughs> I could not find it. But basically, I have nude hangers with like a gold handle. And I could find them on Amazon. But I really wanted them to be the same exact color. And sometimes you get hangers and they'll be right. And then it won't be right. 
So I was like, let me just wait to find them. And I finally found them. So now I can hang out the rest of my clothes. And I really want to get this room together. And honestly, I really need to, oh, I need to dust that. I think I need to get my vents cleaned out. Um, I really want to eventually get into maybe actually decorating my room. <laughs> I I still don't know what I'm gonna do yet. Um, let me put you on a, a tripod because I don't feel like holding this. Yeah, so as you guys can see, my room is a mess. <laughs> I am in the process of doing laundry. I'm on my third load right now. And I actually just took this load out, so I'm about to get my closet together and put this stuff up. And I really think I'm going to start decorating this room. I have kind of stopped from decorating anything because I did not know if I was going to stay in this house. And I still don't know if I'm going to stay in this house. Good morning. Well, it's really not morning, it's afternoon. Today is Saturday and I it's five o'clock. I actually just it's six o'clock. Bro, she braids fast. Okay. And it's six o'clock. I just got my hair braided. It looks really, really, really good to me. And it was it was kind of cheap, like for what I got. Well, my length is not long, but for what she, I mean, it looks pretty good. I don't like my edges to be out. Not that girl. <laughs> I'm not, cause my hair is really soft. So eventually the edges will slip out eventually. So if I leave edges out in the beginning, my hair will start to look atrocious. It's not cute. <laughs> so yeah, there's that. So I am about to head to Sam's Club. I need to get some paper towel and toilet paper. And then I also want to see what they have, like any new things they have. And then after that, I'm gonna go to Home Goods. Oh, shaking really badly, sorry y'all. And then after that, I'm gonna go to Home Goods because I need to get. I just feel like I want to make my home a little more homey. And then I'm gonna go to. And I think I'm gonna go to Sam's Club because I'm right here. And then I'm gonna go find something to eat, and then we'll just go from there. And I also might go ahead and get my nails done today as well because. It's been a while, first of all, my nails and my toes, and they're starting to look a little atrocious. So, I typically paint them myself, but like, I got gel done like once, and it lasts me for two weeks on my real nails, but I think I wanna get, I don't know if I wanna get acrylic or if I just wanna get gel. We'll see, but I definitely am getting a pedicure because I deserve. <laughs> so let me go ahead and go to Sam's, then we'll find somewhere to get, get a pedicure, but before I go get a pedicure, I need to, I need to get something to eat. So there's that. I found this foldable chair which is cute it matches the set but it looks very low and I don't know how this is gonna look it matches the color of the table though I can use this one but I don't like the fact that it doesn't have like the side rails but it's cute though and it's a little small I just finished getting my toes done. I couldn't get my nails done because it was super packed in there and they were taking too long and I have to go. So <laughs> I'm about to go hang with my family and then we're gonna go out to eat and then I'm gonna head back home after that. But I think I'm about to go get some bubble tea because she said that this place is really good and I really want some tea. I feel like these braids make me look like I have a huge forehead and I don't. <laughs> but um, I got my bubble tea. I actually got milk, strawberry milk pretty good it's different but yeah I'm about to go head to my family's house and then we'll go from there hey y'all so I just got home and I'm tired I was gonna like go into a actually into a, a birthday party instead However, <laughs> I didn't feel like recording it because it was in their house and I was like, mm, I don't want people's personal corners to be like showing on here if they're not 
comfortable with it I didn't feel like asking so I am getting undressed right now I'm about to take off my makeup and um, I to lay down so thank you guys for watching the vlog I hope that you guys are enjoying them and you guys have a wonderful day bye